I welcome all of you on platform of your PDA education. Uh, your PDA is the platform which uh, I think uh, uh, where you get entire information about uh, various higher education courses, India, abroad, etc. And you know one of the course uh, which is a master's MS course in India in IITs, IICs, etc. This is a course which a very less student are aware of. I mean they don't know much about this course. There are many misconceptions also related to this course. Students think that uh, uh, this course it is not like M Tech or uh, there's a difference in M Tech and MS. Let me tell you a little bit about this course. MS is of three years, 2.5 to three years. M Tech is of two years. MS is a little more research oriented. M Tech is theoretical uh, course oriented. As far as the placement is concerned, I will say that placement depends upon how much effort you do. If you do really good in MS, you get very good placement. So you cannot say that M Tech has better placement or MS has better placement, but uh, it is more professor directed course. You know, you need to work on project and something like that. So learning case of say, I believe MS may you get more time to learn. Now, what is our ultimate purpose to join master's course in IITs, IIC? What is the ultimate purpose? There are two reasons. Number one, maybe if you want to go for even higher education further and want to pursue career in research, academics, teaching, to MS, M Tech karte hain hum. Uske liye MS is better course. Second, we want to get placement in industries. We want placement. Uske liye placement, I have told you many times, depends upon how much effort you do. If you seriously do your master's course MS M Tech, to MS mein aapko placement milega. Companies will come, you learn many things and uh, placement you get uh, in those companies. So that is also not a trouble. So MS M Tech may you get placement also and MS is a course which provides you opportunity for higher education, etc. also. So sir, in winter admission, MS M Tech seats come. Yes, they come. And this year, more seats are expected because ITs have not filled many seats in MS. Aapko ek video tha jisme in which I told you that uh, ITs are withdrawing the seats from MS this summers uh, because it is uh, online semester only and uh, uh, ITs expect that uh, winter admission may offline courses start ho jayenge, we will put more admission there. So uh, nutshell means more seats are expected in uh, this winter admission. And more actually because uh, MS is a project related course also. So jada seats hai, more seats come for MS. So such if I get MS in good IIT in good uh, core branch or something or interdisciplinary good branch should I join it? Answer is 100% you should join it. And will I get placement? Yes, if you put effort you get placement. Because companies obviously come and uh, when the companies come, if you have credentials, then obviously you get selected into that. And MS is also called mini PhD course because if you have MS and if you apply abroad for PhD or something, then also you get admission into there. Do not uh, get into some kind of uh, misconceptions that MS is not good, M Tech is good. Don't think that because very soon I will bring some students, old students who have done MS and now are working in industries, very good packages. They are getting very good salaries and we'll have panel discussion also, as I told you earlier also. So from there, your this myth will be dissolved that whether I should go for that or not. So MS is equally good as M Tech. In fact, it is better than M Tech because you learn more and you provide you more opportunity to get placement also. Some students say so that if I want to become faculty, where M Tech is a criteria, will MS also be, uh, 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 I mean, eligible? Answer is yes. You are eligible for that. This certainly you are eligible for that. So these are some of the reasons why I should you should join for MS. Now you know your PDA is providing you this uh, consultancy for applying in various courses in IITs, IICs, etc. And you can show your interest if you seek the paid consultancy from your PDA to apply in MS courses and all PhD courses, M Tech courses where research proposal, etc. is required. Uh, yeah, one more thing I want to tell you is that MS courses are those courses in which research proposal normally is required. M Tech may he may may not ask for research proposal, but MS may have research proposal. Chata hai. Another difference in MS M Tech is that the gate score requirement for M Tech is high and MS may BTEC percentage CGPA requirement is high. So if you have very good BTEC CGPA, let's say 8 plus and gate is not that high, then MS se tumhe call a jayega. Lekin agar tumhara BTEC mein percentage is not good, but gate score is high, then M Tech se call a jayega. So M Tech may more weightage is to gate and MS may more weightage to your academic background, academic percentage. And gate score requirement more is in uh, your M Tech and gate score requirement in MS is not that high. 
and same for phd phd also your academic background should be good and gate score requirement is not that high so those of you who have btech cgpa good but gate score is not very good they can think of getting into ms but yes if you want to get selected into ms you should have very good research proposal with you and interviews uh, there will be there so interview you have to clear it so that particular part should be good now your pd as you know provide you consultancy to help you writing your research proposal i mean how it is to be written and then prepare you for interviews also how you have to go for uh, interview and a uh, lot of practice of interviews also done and which courses you should apply that also is done you can seek the consultancy from your pd by filling this form and our executive will get back to you and my genuine request to you is only those of you who seek the paid consultancy should fill the form not others why because uh, it will waste your time also and the time of our executive also it is not that your pda does not want to help you and asking for paid consultancy the point is that uh, the mentor who is going to write your research proposal obviously uh, he is putting his effort for that so i hope you understand that and as i tell in all my videos whatever paid uh, consultancy you seek from your pda that is your investment and that is a value for your money at no stage you will realize that okay you have invested money with your pd and the charges are very less you know all the products of your pda you will see whether it is from gate or ipad or any other they are very very nominal you know they are very nominal so that you can afford especially in this covid situation we know that income of everyone has gone down and uh, not uh, much fees can be uh, shelved out for these activities so yes uh, this is value for your money but yes 20% of all the things are you know, provided free of cost by your pda but then 80% it has to be paid to survive and sustain so this is a paid consultancy and please fill the form if you are interested in paid consultancy our executive will get back to you if you seek admission in ms mtech phd in the winter this is a great opportunity this time and you can prepare well for it and uh, so that you convert it because in the winter interviews are something which are very important research proposal interviews these are important domains i hope you have understood the difference in ms and mtech and you are motivated enough to join these courses thank you